true. Anyway, here we go. We got game one. We got an ABB team of Kinky Oats and Zyro coming up from the losers bracket. This is another rather staple ABB team, but just uh, you know, from an age before the pandemic, these two liked the team a lot. I remember. Yeah, this is a bygone era right here. Late 2018, early 2019, Zyro Kinky Oats. Yeah, I remember. Zyro Kinky Oats used to be the the kings of of ABB doubles. They're still kings in our hearts. Oh, they're still kings. 100%. Undoubtedly, but right now we got you know what they're doing really well against this uh, winter side team right now Pangolin and Plum These two. Oh my gosh. Yeah. That was that was crazy. That flying slam from Zyro Kinky Oats actually uh, holding on nicely not taking too much damage right now. All right. Good stuff Forward air. Yep. All right, and now we've got a double ledge trap to position. Let's see Pangolin making it through Almost Ooh, getting a kill on Zyro. Did I see the double jump cancels air? Because uh, I think that's a thing he didn't know how to do before. Very stylish stuff there. Mm -hmm. He was a, a very not technical Lucas as opposed to other Lucas players like uh, like Snap, who were more technical and could do some of the other stuff. Plum played more by the books. Plum's all but about I, the fundies. You know? But I'm seeing him use a, use the double jump cancels airs now, so I suppose he's learned how to do it. We got that which, back. Is, which is neat to see. It's a really good option for the character. For sure. The lab practice paying off for sure. Good stuff, Plum. Keep up the hard work, you know? We'd love to see it. You can only imagine how badly Bowser's gonna get comboed around by these two characters, Lucas and Toon Link. Yeah. They're both small little little buggers really. Ooh, but they both died! And yeah, down a stock. At least with Oats hanging on there. Zyro already losing a stock earlier, though. Oats making it back. We're going to get sniped by the PK fire. Not the eyeing properly. Going to uh, lose our stock for that, but that's okay. We got some cheering for Pangolin and Plum in the chat right now. Very nice. Ooh. Zyro landing into uh, Kikyotz's jab as it was happening, but tough guying through it so that he didn't take the last hit. Yeah, we got a nice jab coming out from Oats, knocking Plum across the stage. Zyro gonna go for a ledge trapping situation. All right, Plum off stage without a jump, making it back with a PK Thunder oh, right into Zyro's back big air. Oh, Pangolin almost getting the Z drop bomb into the up air, but that hitbox is just a little too narrow for that to connect. All right, down tilt. Whoa! Both players wanted to attack each other there for sure. Both Zyro and Pangolin. The Uppy. The hero spin. Oh, is that a dead Toon Link? It, it is. It is a dead Toon Link. You could say it was a trade that was worth it, though. They were both at pretty high percent. That's true. Yeah. I have a feeling, though, I don't think Zyro meant to SD there. I think that he yeah, wanted to. Yeah, he just to, hit yeah. it too low. Yeah, exactly. Oh, nice parry on the forward air. Going for an up tilt or two. Gonna get hit by that bomb. And a little jab from ledge. Well, not an actual jab, but like a thrust, rather. Get up attack. Mm -hmm. All right, bombs away now. Raining with the Z drops coming down, but Tangle is the only one getting hit by them, unfortunately. All right, that's the end of Kinky Oats. And um, we'll see if Zyro is able to pull out the TV one. Everyone's at a fairly high percent, but Bowser is much heavier, so. He's got, he's got a bit more durability left in him than these other two. Exactly. Like there's a, one side beyond each of them, and that that would be it. For sure. That's what I was thinking as well. Is that but oh. that that nope. He just never got the chance. Pangolin and Plum taking a pretty solid game one. It was not like a wash by any means. Both teams were putting up a serious fight there. They were just able to edge it out in the end. Yeah. So let's see what happens now. Game two, could Zyro and Oats bring it back? Or yeah, we just... I mean, the game could very easily just go slightly different. Exactly. What do you think was like the turning point in the match for blue team? Uh, I don't know. I think it was just like when the game was, it was close. They were all, they just, when like anyone could die, like it was, it was, uh, it was Lucas, Toon Link, Wendy and Bowser all at high percent. Kinky Oats was the first one to die. And that was really what did it. I suppose, yeah. All right, very interesting character change here coming out from Zyro. Yeah, well, Jigglypuff? Jigglypuff Rob? I, 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 I think it's just for fun. I mean, it's definitely just for fun, yeah. but I, I don't think I've ever seen him play Jigglypuff. Me neither. <laughs> so. <laughs> Starting off with a rollout and actually hitting. 
Okay, so... Not very different from the last game. I mean, we're on Town & City for the first time in a few games. Mm-hmm. Like, the entire last set was played on PS2. Mm-hmm. And so was the first game there. Yep. Now we're on a different stage. Yeah, red team kind of taking a bit of a beating right now. So, uh, we'll see what this Jigglypuff I can do, I suppose. Alright, we're gonna get a weak dash attack into a forward air. And uh, the, the, the up tilt into up air from Pangolin. Zyra was getting really ballsy there for some damage off stage. Okay. And well, they're in the lead. Maybe Jigglypuff. Maybe he knows something we don't know with this Jigglypuff. I don't know. I think. Um. I, uh. Yeah, this Jigglypuff is something, alright. 100%. For better or for worse. That's ultimately up for fate to decide. Or Zyro, I suppose. Oh, I think he just wants to, like, tap him off stage. Get those little gimps. Alright. Getting spiked there by Plum, but not getting knocked off stage. Still living at nearly 150%. Nah, they're good now. 100%. I, was, I, I think the, what Zyro wanted was, like, I'm at 150%. Wouldn't it be funny if I could hit a rest and then just be okay with dying? Yeah, no, that definitely sounds like something Zyra would do. It's something I would do. It's definitely something you would do, yeah. <laughs> we got that spin attack, or, or the hero spin, I believe it's called for Toon Link. Uh, no, I think it's just called spin attack for all three of the links. Oh. For me, Sword Fighter, it's hero spin. Gotcha, okay. Learn something new every day. Thank you, Andrew. <laughs> Remember in Smash 4, Toon Link had a custom up B variant that resembled the hurricane spin from Wind Waker, where you could just, like, <laughs> Slide across the stage. That was so silly. Fortunately, uh, no customs were generally points. pretty silly. And hella unbalanced. Yep. But everyone's heard that story by now. But they were really funny. It could be, yeah. But right now we got red team and entire stock up right now. Oh my gosh. Zyro almost putting Pangolin away. I think Oats just saved Pangolin. I don't know if he I could don't have made that think back. so. I think he would have made it. Oh really? Okay. We're in something. And I guess they're letting him rock out with the 2v1 here. Alright, Zyro believing in himself. Kinky Oats with some very, very strong support coming out right now. Saying, if anyone plays video games, it is you. That's undeniably Which, a fact. It, it, I do agree, he plays video games. I do agree, yeah, for sure. Zyro is definitely the kind of guy to play video games. I'm not denying that. I think I've seen him do it many times, but Me I'd have to check. All right, but he's, uh, he's getting some nice licks in here and there. A little back air on Plum. Unable to get through the wall. I don't know if he's getting much of a chance to play the video game right now. Yeah, you have no range. You're just a little floaty balloon. Yep. The little F smash from Toon Link. Yeah. One game away from a 30 and a handshake. One person playing video games can't overcome two people playing video games. Yeah, it's That's hard. That's double the video gaming power. What can you do? Just, just accept your demise, unfortunately. Sometimes that's all we can do. Yeah. As uh, as we as we live in this in this video gaming society. Like the society that looks down on video gamers. You know, what are you doing? Get a real job. We got <laughs> what do you do When you take a video gamer and put him in a society that abandons him. You and get a team of two very fun to play with DLC characters. Oh, this, this is the pe this is peak fun. That's the punchline of your joke. Two two very fun DLC characters. That's what the gamer goes to when the society abandons him and treats him like trash. <laughs> Min Min. In other words, you end up with Min Min. Getting what you deserve. All right, game two here, or game three rather. Just Min Min and Banjo Kazooie. Banjo Kazooie actually is coming back to Nintendo Switch on the Nintendo 64 online. I know a lot right. of people are excited about that. And uh. If I want to play Banjo-Kazooie, I will do this funny thing called emulating it. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes, yes. That's true. Nope, nope. Don't know if I'm Nintendo to, reps are watching. I'm going to burn Nintendo on the stake. Dang. You know what? I respect your mission, Evie. I just don't want to... I don't want a bad look, you know? I want a terrible look. To each their own. So, uh, this counterpick actually... My, my, my comments do not represent the views of ABB. No, 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 it's just Evie Necessarily. Alright, so, gonna be a Ram Ram there, killing Kinky Oats of all people, unfortunately. 
Okay, I'm sure everyone's heard by now the the, the name and the Japanese version of Banjo's Down B, right? I think so. It's it's called Ass Egg. Oh, <laughs> yeah. right. <laughs> I mean, it, are you, are, is it wrong? Is it inaccurate? Not in the slightest. No, I think an, he's an egg shitter. I think ass grenade would have been funnier, but like, it is what it is. Oats off stage without a jump, but I forgot that Banjo has two and getting that Wonder Wing recovery. It's hard to challenge, but easy to just Ow. stay out of the range and punish. And uh, we've got like a we've got a lead on the red team right now, so. Yeah, Plum on the latter half of his last stock here. This uh, counter pick actually kind of doing wonders. Ooh, that was a good combo by Pangolin, though. Oh, for sure. Good stuff. Oats down to his last stock now. Let's see what we got here. Oh. Ooh, good spike. Yes. Nice. Okay, so now they've got the lead, like technically, and it's gone. Oh, never mind. Okay, down to a last stock game now for every player on board. Relatively mm -hmm. even, all things considered. I love when Min Min gets to smash attack him twice. Fun, fun I character I also love when people don't know how to punish it. <laughs> yeah, those people not knowing how to punish Min Min smash attack spams. God, yeah. Yeah, imagine that. <laughs> Pain. I would simply be someone who does know how to punish it. <laughs> Just like, if it were me different. in that situation. Are we gonna see the? Someone could do it. Like the... you just have to kill Tinkers, and then you have to kill Zyra's Min Min. I don't know how many Wonder Wings Oats has left, but like you do not. And you have to stop getting hit by the second forward smash. Yeah, exactly. The dragon, and then the big or Ram Ram. You just have to treat it like a multi-part F smash, like Links or something. You block the first one. If the second one is coming, block that one too. It's actually a really good way of putting it. Oh no! And he's dead. He is, and that's gonna be. Game three going to the blue team. Red team, it's... It was Sorry, incredibly the... fun. Yeah. Fun times. Good DLC. Well designed. Love Smash Ultimate. Cannot wait for the final DLC character who it's... I bet is going to be just as well designed as the rest of it's Fighter gonna, Pass 2. It's, it's going gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna to be the most cool and awesome... It's, everyone's going to play the last DLC character because they're just going to love him so much. He's going to have like Arsene, Go, One Wing... Ram Ram. The ability to switch to Pyra. Yep. <laughs> and uh, command grab projectile. Like our good friend Steve. Mm -hmm. Oh, and random Steve. crits. That too, that too, don't forget that. And an invincible, unchallengeable side B. And electric wind godfist. <laughs> Shoutouts to Mr. Mishima. Speaking of Steve, actually, Zaro switching over. And we got the plants as well coming out from Oats. So we are still DLC. Mm -hmm. Why would you play characters that came out with the game when you could play characters that happened later than that? And were just better for the most part. I... Mm, a piranha plant? Oh, well, not these two, but okay. Well, maybe Steve. Steve is like one of the worst fighters past two characters. But he's still absurd. He's pretty funny. Tyra, Mithra, Sephiroth, Min Min, the good, the, all the fun lads. Oh, they're just so well designed in this fighting game. Wow. Really early stock there on Pangolin. Zyro, Zyro gaming really hard right now. Ooh, Plum went for the up smash and it absolutely would have killed. We're gonna see some damage coming out here on Oats from Plum. Getting hit by a minecart though. Zyro not getting an optimal conversion, but it's okay. Probably that was the best he could do in that stage. That back here almost killed. Alright, everyone making it back but Zyro, unfortunately. Quick wake up up smash there. Now, this game is close to even, but Kinky is still on his first stop. Yeah. And. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh, that almost ended badly. For sure, we're gonna see a quick downer coming out from Pangolin in there. Gonna put away Oats for good. This Oh, not for good, we're just losing a stock. Now, if you're the blue team in this situation, I think your biggest fear is Zyro getting golden diamonds. Definitely. You also like can't get too comfortable fighting Oats on the opposite If you're Zyro and oh, okay. Crazy man. Zyro almost SDing, but not quite. From the funny block man. God, he's just hilarious. So I'm confused. Is, this, is that supposed to be like a tennis player costume, Steve's one? I think so. I think it's a tennis thing. That makes sense. All right, nice there from Kinky Oats, knocking Plum down to his last stock, maintaining this red team lead. 
Alright, we're gonna see a hero sp or a spin attack there. Not gonna kill yet. Ooh. The, the Patui still coming down on Plum there. Oh, wow. Nice platform cancel from Zyra. Pivot grab, back throw. Now he's got stone. And now he's got diamond, but I don't think he'll build it on this stock. Yeah, let's see what happens. Things are uh, looking... Oh, Mikio has died, but uh, Red Team still has a lead. They do, they do. So, so long as Kinkyo's can keep his percentage low, mm -hmm. they're still in this, yeah. And also, uh, don't forget, the moment Zyro dies, he has Diamond. That's true, but you have to keep in mind, Pangolin's still got a spare stock to work with. Mm -hmm. Pangolin's still got a spare stock to work with. But, uh... Okay. So the game's looking about even percent-wise, but again, Zyro now has Diamond. Yeah, both red team Which players. Which is um, kind of scary if you're blue team, given that you're both really not wanting to die right now. <laughs> yeah, potentially down to the tournament stocks here. Let's see, just quick little jabs. But uh, ever since coming back with the diamond, Zyro's been unable to get a hit. Oh, quite nice. Yeah, of course Oates is going to make that back. I don't know why. Yeah. Yeah, Piranha Plant's got a pretty long distance recovery. He just can't hit anyone with this diamond. Plum and Pangolin are like, no, we won't let you. Yeah, they're playing around it really well. They're just... They're dialing it up to 11 on this fighting Steve well. And like, at the perfect time. Like, he hasn't gotten anything. And he accidentally kills Pinky Oates and himself. <laughs> so he my card. It looked intentional, I think, but it was a total accident. <laughs> like I, they just talked about it. He was